Tonight I'm fishing with a special guest on my boat. It's Ty with fvcatfish.com. Please check out his YouTube channel in the iCard above. He also has a guide service as well. As soon as his arm heals up a little bit. But we're going to see if we can catch something with a guy who has a broken arm. I definitely got to work on the camera angle on the boat. Come on, take it. Man, that's turned me absolutely bonky. Now, as you guys are about to see, we've been getting bites all evening long. Oh, oh, take it, take it. Oh, oh. Come on, take it. That one might be there. Little channel cat. What do you think? All of a sudden, we're getting a... See if they stay committed to it. He's still there. No. Nope. Yeah. That was, that was crazy though, like both, all three of those rods started getting. Yeah. Oh. Oh, that's about right. Good enough for government work. <laughs> But he loves the live bait. Bass and stuff. Yeah, I've been meaning to do that. Live, some live bait bass. I need to catch my trophy sized bass. I bought, what, 20 goldfish? Grew them all summer long. Yeah. Didn't catch a single fish with any of them. Come on, take it. Which one? Come on. Oh, that's the one I just put out. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> it's got to be a little bitty thing. You know, and then down on our lakes, we can't hardly catch a channel. Huh. We just almost never do. Yeah, this lake is chock full of them. I and mean, I think it's just too much competition from the blues drives the channels up to the creeks and stuff. We'll catch them real thick right below the dam. One thing about fish, you think you got them figured out, you don't. <laughs> got a bite on number two, number four, number five, and number six. I did a video a long time ago, I don't know if you ever saw it, about what rod gets the most amount of bites. And I had just video after video where I rolled every takedown over all kinds of places, and number five was the winner. Hmm. Oh, 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 come on. Yeah, for a second, I was like, that looks way more serious. <laughs> Man, a lot of bites here. <laughs> He's really wanting that. I'm calling the park to see if they're still open. He might be there. The little one. Yep. <laughs> Just a little feller. Hey, it's the fish. Man, that's a lot of work on that. <laughs> you need me to take over. <laughs> oh, there goes the drilling pump. Maybe you got it over this line. Yeah. <laughs> Great. 
Nice channel cat. Hi, hi. You have no idea how hard some things are when... <laughs> you got a broken arm? Yeah. Hey, you don't have it. Turn this light on here. Maybe it'll help out. Sweet. <laughs> Seriously, that's like the biggest channel I've seen in a while. And he caught it with a broken arm. Yeah, I gotta be careful. I get too much slime on that. That's gonna stink. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Wanna well, let him go? Been down in the mud, hasn't he? Yeah. One arm release. Thanks for making sure nothing was in vain. Bye. That's pretty good. That is the second catfish ever caught on this boat. So I want to check this one. A live bait one? Yeah. It's either snagged or it's got a flathead on it. No, there's nothing there. Oh boy, this feels like it's going to get foggy. Oh, oh, oh. Are you going to go down? Maybe. Maybe not. Saw that. Kind of. He's trying, isn't he? Yeah. It's a good size channel. I mean, I know they get a lot bigger, but yeah, I catch so many of them dinky ones. It's... <laughs> it really is crazy that as many blues, big blues and flatheads as we'll see, just do not see the channels that big. Uh, I mean, I caught a 20 pound channel out of this lake. <laughs> oh, I can kind of see it. It's just a different kind of a um ecosystem up here but it's about that time and we caught yeah. one yeah all right whoa Ow. all right we're reeling up uh hopefully we'll be able to uh get out of the park i know they close right around dark so we're going to get back to the ramp and get to the gate before they close it here but one fish is better than no fish this actually has been a rough weekend for me i've had trouble catching any fish this weekend but that's how it goes one of these days i'll get a big 50 pounder in on this boat for now that was a good fish and it's always great fishing with ty i'll have to go out on his boat again someday maybe we can uh catch a whole bunch of flatheads again as always guys please hit that thumbs up and thank you for watching time to get back to the ramp